This is the Homejoy 5-speed electric hand mixer. It's available in red, black, and white. This is the red one. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get the user manual. Here is the mixer itself. Like I said, it's in red, stainless steel around it like that. Comes with a single whisk. Your two beaters, and these are actually pretty heavy duty, nice quality stuff here. And also two dough hooks if you're going to be making dough. Another nice thing is it comes with this storage case here, so all of the accessories there can fit in that. Then the mixer fits on top of that, and everything is stored together so you don't lose anything. And there is the mixer with the storage case on there with the accessories. You'll notice also there is a cutout here for the cord. I could have looped that down and stored the cord in there with it, so it's one nice compact unit, but I'm just going to be opening this up now anyways. Here's the mixer itself. Single button eject right there. Five speeds right here, so that's your speed control. And it also has the turbo button. What that is going to do for you, let's say you're on speed two, for example, and you just need a burst of a little bit more power. If you press the turbo button, see it clicks now, as long as you hold it, it'll go up to speed five and stay there as long as you hold it. And then when you let go, it'll go back to whatever speed that you had it on. And of course, it's flat there, so you can also set it and stand it upright like that. First thing I want to do, I want to just run it just so you can see how it'll run before we actually go and make something here. So I'm going to put this on, I'll go through all the speeds, and then I'm going to go back down to low and press the turbo button so you see how that works. And now speed one. And now I'll press the turbo button and you'll see it's going to speed up to speed five. Okay, let's make some whipped cream. All right, we're all set. So I'm gonna go ahead, I have some heavy cream in the bowl, and we'll go ahead and turn the mixer on. I'm gonna start on low, and we're just gonna mix this for a while. Eventually I'll change speeds to go a bit higher to make things go faster. Still needs to go a little bit more, but I'm going to add some sugar now. So this is about a quarter cup of sugar. I'm going to add that and we'll keep mixing. Now yeah, we're getting some peaks there, so that should be good enough to taste. So let me get a spoon. Absolutely wonderful. Now we'll do a couple of eggs here. I'm going to be breading some chicken later, so I'm going to need egg. So here we are. Incidentally, you too can crack an egg with one hand. You don't need two to do it. Okay, now that we have those in the bowl, I'll just clean my hands up for a second here. I have switched over to the whisk. You just get one. You can't have two because they entangle within each other. And we're going to go ahead and whisk these up.
really fast. Now I'm not going to be making any dough today, but I did want to show you a nice safety feature of the unit. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is unplug it, and now I'm going to switch it on to high, or medium, or any speed you want. If you try and eject the beaters, it will not let you. They will not go while that switch is on in any position. Must be off in order for them to eject. So this way, if you absentmindedly or inadvertently go for the eject button instead of the turbo button, or rest your thumb on there and start pressing harder, you can't accidentally eject the beaters. So once again, this was the Homejoy 5-speed electric hand mixer. Did a fine job for everything I whipped up. I guess pun intended. Seemed to work very well for me. Like I said, it's available in red, white, and black. If you'd like to purchase this item, I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find the item available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.